X Global drops a new joint called Years Later. After a really long week and maybe even a year if you really think about it, the Reese vs Wrecking Crew drama continues to unfold. Now looking back at X Global was the guy that had Reese's back when everyone was ducking and diving and leaving him solo. He supported him way back. Even MASH supported him early in the days of the beef. Now X Global dropped real confrontation last week taking a shot at Reese's song called Confrontation, mostly even though the song is about both Reese and Jody. So Jody kind of missed some shots over there. Shout out to Jody. In the song, X Global was basically saying Reese never made them stars. They all together helped each other and all round, which could be a fair statement. Now, with the new song, X Global continues to take shots at Reese. Let's have a look at some of the lyrics, more specifically the hook and the verse by X Global and leave Krish out of this one, okay? Because, you know, we don't want to drag him in something he's got nothing to do with and I hope I called his name right. Okay, let's have a listen to what happened. This is the first thing that he says in the intro. He comes out really, really sharp. What is there to figure out? You could sacrifice for me and they cut you out. I could remember a better way to talk about it cause you can't, you can't blame it on me. Straight off the bat, it's pretty obvious he's taking shots off the song, he's not trying to get anybody to like wait until the verse for him to know or for us to know what's gonna happen. He goes straight into it. What is there to figure out? He doesn't want anybody thinking anything else but what he's saying. You could sacrifice for him and then they cut you out. That's what he's saying. Straight to Reese. He sacrificed for Reese and they cut him out. I should recommend a better way to talk about it because you can't. You can't blame it on me. He says he doesn't have anything to do with it. Okay, let's have a look at the verse. When you see me coming down, all my dogs here, we're coming full speed and we get you out the way when you know he's someone we don't need. Okay, there again, they're talking about somebody that you don't need. Is he talking about Reese? It's obvious. Continue on the verse. I'm at a point where they can't believe how I am bigger in a couple of weeks. How am I that that they truly need? How am I important if I've never seen? How is she alone if she's been here with me? Wow, lot said over there, but if you really have a look at what he's saying, he's basically saying is, how am I bigger in a couple of weeks? He's talking about the fact that he's released only one big song in the past couple of weeks and a lot of people are saying he's hitting some really big numbers and of course the song has hit about 50k views already which is really really huge I'm not sure if he's talking about musical numbers here but let me know what you think on the comment section below but in my opinion I think that he's saying he's getting more traction off his song than Reese got off his song how am I important if I've never seen how is she alone if she's been here with me wow again some more shots He's basically saying over here that he's not the kind of guy you want to play with. He's high at the top. No one can ever be a low if they're chilling with him. He moves on and says, how are you big when they don't pay you the fee? Some of that ish will always bother me. Okay, again, maybe they're shooting shots at Reese and saying, how is he big if they don't pay him as much money as other big artists to come out and perform? And that kind of stuff kind of bothers him, he says. Moving on to the chorus, we go back to the same thing. You could sacrifice for bros and they cut you out. I should recommend a better way to talk it out because you can't, you can't blame it on me. At the end of all of this, the question is, when would it all stop? The back and forth, the you used me, I used you. Do the fans want it to stop? Us as Haven? The more we report on it, do we fuel it? Should we fuel it? Isn't it good for SA Hip Hop? Because it gets the people going. Too many questions I pose, but you let me know in the comment section below. Alright, that's all I got. Please sub for more. Shout out to X Global, shout out to Jody and A Reese for keeping the culture alive. I hope it keeps going. Alright, please sub for more.